Yo, what's good, uh, gamers? Uh, everyone in general. Ladies and gents, uh, this is your boy Gamer 92 Back with another video. Sorry about that. And, uh, yeah, I just got back, uh, from, uh, a couple of places. I stopped by GameStop. And I, well, I actually went to Walmart first, because, uh, uh, my money came, my refund check. They put it on my card today, like around three something. So I was stoked about that. I was like, I'm about to go crazy spending. First thing I'm finna get is a laptop. Yeah, the laptop I wanted for like a decent price was sold out. And uh, it was kind of getting late. And I didn't feel like going to another Walmart. So I just ended up getting a couple of things. From there, I got three movies. Which I already have like the previous movies that came before these of them. Which I have all the all the Fast and Furious one through six, so I was missing Furious Seven, which I went and saw in theaters, but I have not yet got around to getting the movie. Cause I don't know, been sleeping on it, so I went and picked that up. And uh, another movie I like, I'm a big fan of the Marvel movies, and uh, I have every one of them, minus uh, the Incredible, I think the Incredible Hulk. I gotta get that one, but that really, I don't think I really count that one in with the MCU, like with the Thor and all that, but I think they do, because I think that's a part of phase one, if I'm not mistaken, so I do gotta get that one. What I watched that before? I think I watched it before, I don't know. What movie would that come before, though? Uh, gotta think. But, um, yeah, so yeah, I picked up uh, Avengers Age Ultron. I fucking love this movie. I actually watched it on bootleg because I couldn't get around to going to the movies because I was busy with work and stuff. So I watched it on my website when I got home. The night it came out, they had it up. So I checked it out on there. And I also got the movie that came after that, which I went, I went and saw this with my cousin. I think it was the last movie me and him went to see before he went to, he moved to California. But uh, yeah, it, man, which we didn't catch the beginning. We missed like the first like 10 minutes of it. So but yeah, it was still a, still an amazing movie all around. But yeah. Wonder what that is behind me that I'm watching. It's a uh, Gotham. No, actually, when I, they first announced that show, I was like, oh, I don't, I'm not gonna watch that. I said the same thing about Supergirl, but then I'm not gonna lie. I think it was that they're doing the crossover with Flash, the Flash and Supergirl, which I watched the Flash and Arrow, so big fans of those shows. So I've uh, got started watching Supergirl, and it's actually a decent show. I actually like it. Same for Gotham, you know, they got James Gordon, you know, Penguin, Victor, Victor, uh, Sav, Saz, uh, freaking, Car uh, Carmine Falcon, a uh, bunch of, bunch of people, they even have, like, Ivy on there, she's a little kid, Catwoman's a little kid, but she goes by Cat. And they actually even have Bruce Wayne. They show the whole thing. That first episode, I think it starts with the with the Bruce Wayne's uh, murder. Parents, his uh, with the Wayne's murder case. When his parents getting murdered. But yeah, it's a pretty good show. You know, I recommend it. Check it out. I still on season one. I think I'm on like episode 15. I had paused this like head to the store, but I'm about to finish up watching that. But then I went to GameStop. Actually, the whole reason we went for the laptop, I mean, I was getting my little nephews. Some little Disney Infinity figures that they wanted. They wanted Perry the Platypus and Phineas, but I was able to find Perry. He was buried behind a bunch of stuff, but we couldn't find Phineas, which I was telling my nephew, a bunch of kids watch Phineas and Ferb, so I keep telling him, you're probably not going to find this. I'm like, you want to get Thor or somebody? He's like, he's persistent. He wants Phineas. You know how kids are, so I went to GameStop. I wasn't even planning on buying no game because, you know, I got to shitload of stuff over there that I'm still working on. And uh so I was just browsing around. I was gonna get that that Unchimbara with the chicks fighting zombies in bikinis. The chicks in bikinis fighting zombies or something like that. I was gonna get that with thirty bucks and I was like nah. So I uh, ended up getting a game I previously had on the PS3, which I never got around to beating and I traded it in. Cause I got bored of it. Well, I shouldn't get bored of it. It was like I'm, I was telling myself I'm never going to get back to playing this. So, plus, I, no, I traded in once they announced the definitive edition of this game. So, if I, I'll just, if I ever want to get back to it, I'll just replay it on the definitive edition. So, yeah, that game is uh, 
Dishonored. Got it for freaking 18 bucks. Things are 33 gigabytes. Well, yeah, I'll probably play it. But then again, I, I'm getting Firewatch tomorrow. Because I got that. I got that. I got a $20 PSN uh, code from uh, JTEC TV, aka Pyro. Well, it used to be Pyro. But, um, yeah, shout out to JTEC for uh, doing the whole giveaway with the code so that I can. I had that ahead of time to pay off uh, Firewatch, which I will be streaming tomorrow. So keep a lookout for that. And uh, that's pretty much it. I just want to show you guys that. And, um, yeah, I'm about to probably hop back on uh, Gotham and watch about four more episodes. I'm trying to finish season one by the night so I can start two tomorrow. I don't think I'm that behind in two. I'm probably like, they don't like the 12th or 13th episode in season two, but yeah. This is your boy Gamer Rick. I didn't mean for this to be a lengthy video, but uh, I'll let you guys. Peace.